It's that time again. It's late spring and new life is emerging in every ecosystem and the neighborhood pond is no exception. Proud parents watch, exhausted from sweaty, furious lovemaking as their offspring take their first steps into the world. These signs all really mean one thing. The fat mama bass are ready to slurp that 130 and daddy's gonna feed it to them. All right, guys, today we are skating to one song and one song only, and that song is catching a giant bass on the Whopper Plopper 130. There was overcast just a minute ago. We just had a cold front roll in, but now it is sunny. Water visibility is about two feet. The weeds around the bank are absolutely horrendous. So we might be picking weeds off of our hooks pretty frequently, but that's okay. And right now we're just getting into June. So most of these fish are going to be post spawn and they've had enough time to recover. So they should be out a little bit deeper, feeding up and getting fat again. Early summer is absolutely my favorite time for the Whopper Plopper. And this pond has some big ones. So I got the 130 on. Let's see if we can catch one. Got one. Oh, that's a big fish. That's a big fish. That's a big fish. Come on. Oh, gotta get over to my net. Oh. Oh yeah. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. We want to land this guy. Come on. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. oh boy. Woo! Look at that. That's a tank. Oh, oh, oh. oh, careful, careful. Let's get this hook out of him real quick. There we go. Oh my goodness. That is a big pond bass right there. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. oh I love the Whopper Flopper. Oh my gosh. Guys, look at this bass. That has to be over four pounds, might be pushing four and a half. That has the potential to be five pounds if it filled out just a little bit more. I don't know. I have my scale. I'm going to try and get a weight real quick inside the net and then I'll, uh, I'll have to weigh my net afterward and we'll try to get an approximate weight, but it's pushing five pounds. That's a big pond bass right there. <clears throat> All right. Mouth closed at 21 inches. All right, first let's just give this fish a quick drink. All right guys, zeroed out here on the scale. Six point oh four in the net. Off the top of my head, I think the net is 1.42 pounds, which would put this one just over four and a half pounds. All right guys, look at this fish. It's an absolute tank. Its eyeballs are almost as big as mine. It's a girthy. My goodness. Let's watch her swim off. Still in good shape. Nice healthy release. Yes! <laughs> that right there is one of the things I love most about summertime. Is catching those big hogs on the Whopper Plopper. All right, let's keep going. See if we can get another one. All right, I'm gonna be mobile and try to cover as much water as I can. It's pretty rare that I would catch one that size and then catch another one in the same spot. So we're only hunting giants today. Wanna move to a different spot. Got one. <laughs> Not a big one. <laughs> Especially for the 130. Oh, oh, careful, bud. Don't want you to hurt. Oh. There we go. 
Don't hurt yourself and don't hook me, bud. Neither one of us would enjoy that. Thanks for biting. Fish was almost the same size as the Whopper Plopper. Got another one. That's a better one. That's a better one. Very next cast after that little one. Got a better one here. Easy, 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 easy. Oh, yes. Oh, it's another Mondo. Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh. Look at this, guys. Look at that. Oh. Oh, it's almost the same size as the first one. It might be longer. The giants are out today. Let's go. Look at this fish, guys. Look at this. It's another 21. It's the same length. Look at that thing. Look at that. Another absolute beast. All right, guys, I'm not gonna weigh this one because it's definitely not as heavy as that first one, but it's definitely over four pounds and it's 21 inches, just like the first fish we caught. That is an absolute pond monster. Let's get it back in. Holy crap, you guys. Giant bass number two on the day. Make sure this fish is okay. It's already kicking. There she goes. Nice and easy, nice healthy release. Back to the depths. Oh, that's amazing. No joke, guys. I fantasize about the Whopper Plopper all winter long. And when summer comes around, I cannot wait to come out here and in all of the bodies of water that I fish and throw that big Whopper Plopper. It catches some absolute giants. Absolute giants. I'd like to remind all the viewers right now that I'm in Michigan. Those are two Michigan four plus pounders out of a neighborhood pond. All right, I reckon we got about 30 to 45 minutes left of daylight. I'm going to move, cover some more water, see if we can find yet another tank of a bass. And believe it or not, guys, the bass are actually not the biggest fish in this pond. And the biggest fish in this pond will also eat the Whopper Plopper. I have yet to catch one. But there is a mystery monster fish out here, and I would love to catch my first one today, especially after already catching two giants like that. This side of the pond is even more protected from the wind, so the Whopper Plopper can call them from further away. I don't know if we're going to catch a giant over here, but I think we'll catch another one. Got one. Oh, that might be another good one. That might be another good one. Stay down, stay down. Oh, I think we got another good one, guys. Oh my gosh. This is an unreal day, guys. Unreal. Not as big as the last couple, I think, but still pretty good. Oh, yes. Nice. <laughs> Not quite as big, but still a nice one. Look at that, guys. A nice fat one and a half, one and three quarter pounder. Love it. Love them all. Let's get right back in there because this is the perfect time to be throwing the plopper. Oh, I was watching a blow up to my left and one hit my plopper. <laughs> it was just sitting there. Oh, I think it's another nice one. <laughs> I don't know if it's a, a giant, but I think it's a decent one. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's a decent one. <gasps> oh boy, <laughs> about the same size as the last one. All right, that was a close one. I was watching a blow up over here and I heard the splash of this guy blowing up on the Whopper plopper. I'm lucky I set the hook when I did. All right, let's see if we can get another one. Oh, there's another one out there. You guys just saw that, right? <laughs> there might be a good amount of fish schooled up right there. All right, let's pick up and cover some more water before it gets dark. Look how pretty the sunset is, you guys. 
absolutely beautiful but that also means we don't have much time left i still got to cover this entire side of the pond so we're gonna keep moving keep casting see if we can get one more big out of here something big just swam off right here very well might have been a carp but you never know you never know in this pond the water now is totally different than it was when we first came out the wind was blowing it was super choppy and now it's completely calm they're still feeding you guys <laughs> they're still feeding we just got to put it in front of one i think we'll catch another got one. Oh, oh no it's a tiny guy <laughs> oh he came off <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh i thought it was a little bit bigger fish and i just launched him just look how beautiful the sky is right now you guys i should be making a few more casts to take advantage of the last bit of light here but just look at the sky I just freaking love being outside. I mean, who the hell in their right mind would be inside playing video games or watching a movie on a day like this? All right, let's fish this bank over here one more time in a last ditch effort to catch one more giant before the sun goes down here. Oh, 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 oh no. Another little guy. <laughs> oh, hold still, bud. Hold still. Oh, look at that, guys. <laughs> oh, the hooks on the 130 are a little bit too big for those little bass, but they can still get caught enough to get launched. I'm always expecting a big fish on the 130, but that is not always the case. All right, one last cast into the sunset. Oh. All right, guys, I have made it back to my house. This is one of my three cats, Nala. Over here is Raja. Hi, Raja. And down here is my third one. This is the troublemaker. She's also the prettiest one. This is Molly. But anyway, guys, here in Michigan, it is post-spawn. It is whopper plopper season. And we're already getting it done. Early June is really the best time to start. And today was no different. We caught a couple of giants. We caught a fair amount of fish and I was only out there for about two hours and 15 minutes or so. Now I'm gonna eat some chicken cordon bleu soup with some homemade croutons. In case you guys didn't know, my wife is an absolute dynamite chef and I eat like a king, that's why I'm fat. It's actually a lack of self-control that has made me fat, but uh, anyway, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.